The wife of the uh, US President Melania Trump is among those who've expressed concern over the policy. Alison Sargent has details. We are children now. Weighing in on the debate surrounding her husband's immigration policy. In a rare foray into controversy, a spokesperson for Melania Trump expressed the First Lady's dismay over splitting apart families at the U.S.-Mexico border. Mrs. Trump hates to see children separated from their families and hopes both sides of the aisle can finally come together to achieve successful immigration reform. It's the same stance as the one taken by her husband, reiterated on Sunday by one of his top advisors. I will tell you that nobody likes this policy. You saw the president on camera, that he wants this to end, but everybody has, Congress he has to act. End. The Trump administration blames Democrats in Congress, but breaking up immigrant families is actually the result of their own zero tolerance policy, announced by Attorney General Jeff Sessions in April. While the policy does not explicitly order the separation of parents from their children, it mandates that all people found crossing the border illegally be prosecuted without exception meaning adults are jailed and their kids placed in shelters or foster care. Nearly 2,000 children were separated from their families between mid-April and the end of May. The controversy has become a flashpoint ahead of midterm elections. On Sunday, Democrats declared a Father's Day of action, joining activists outside of detention centers in Texas and New Jersey, where senators had to fight to visit the facility. This is unfair and unconstitutional. Republicans facing tough re-election battles have also expressed their opposition. My constituents that are outraged, um, they should know that I'm outraged too. Former Republican First Lady Laura Bush also spoke up to condemn the policy, calling it cruel and immoral.